From north to south, east to west, we're going to explore the art. The art full of wonders and mysteries. Welcome to Finding Art. Cancer is a type of disease where cells grow out of control, divide and invade other tissues. With cancer, the normal process of cell division goes out of control. Cells change their nature because mutations have occurred in their genes. All the daughter cells of cancer cells are also cancerous. Let us get to know about pancreatic cancer. Pancreatic cancer symptoms jaundice, pain in the upper abdomen or back, nausea and vomiting, change in bowel motions, either diarrhea or severe constipation, bloating, indigestion or heartburn, fever and shivering, malaise, elevated blood sugars, itchy skin, weight loss and poor appetite, gallbladder enlargement, blood clots. Causes of pancreatic cancer Age 80% of cases are diagnosed in people over the age of 60 years. It is uncommon in people under 40. Diabetes The association between pancreatic cancer and diabetes is less understood. It is possible that the cancer causes some cases of diabetes. Genetics There may be a genetic link in up to 1 in 10 cases of pancreatic cancer. A number of gene mutations can increase your risk like breast cancer gene 2, BRCA2. Race. Studies in the United States have shown that pancreatic cancer is more common in the African-American population than it is in the white population. Gender. Cancer of the pancreas is more common in men than in women. Religious background. Pancreatic cancer is proportionally more common in Ashkenazi Jews than the rest of the population. Other reasons include chronic pancreatitis, obesity, diet, cigarette smoking. Diagnosis Computed tomography or CT scan. The CT scan uses x-rays to produce detailed cross-sectional images of your body. They can also help show if cancer has spread to organs near the pancreas. CT guided needle biopsy. CT scans can also be used to guide a biopsy needle into a suspected pancreatic tumor. Magnetic Resonance Imaging or MRI MRI scans use radio waves and strong magnets. The energy from the radio waves is absorbed by the body and then released in a pattern formed by the type of body tissue and by certain diseases. A computer translates the pattern into a detailed image of parts of the body. Special types of MRI scans include MRCP and MRA. Abdominal Ultrasound A wand-shaped probe called a transducer is moved over the skin of the abdomen. It gives off sound waves and detects the echoes as they bounce off organs. The echoes made by most pancreatic tumors differ from those of normal pancreas tissue. Endoscopic ultrasound. This test is more accurate than abdominal ultrasound. The test is done with a small ultrasound probe on the tip of an endoscope, a thin flexible tube that doctors use to look at the inside of the digestive tract. Cholangiopancreatography. A cholangiopancreatogram is an imaging test that looks at the pancreatic and bile ducts to see if they are blocked, narrowed, or dilated. The test can be done in different ways, ERCP, PTC, SRS, angiography. This is an x-ray test that looks at the blood vessels. A small amount of contrast material is injected into an artery to outline the blood vessels and then x-rays are taken. Blood tests Blood tests for exocrine pancreatic cancer, liver function tests, tumor markers, Blood tests for pancreatic neuroendocrine tumors, blood test for carcinoid tumors. Biopsy Biopsy means to remove a small piece of a tumor. It includes percutaneous biopsy, endoscopic biopsy, surgical biopsy. Thanks for watching. This is your host, Tracy Gomez. Please subscribe. See you in my next video.